Hey guys, uh, Martin here from Aviation Fargo, and the aircraft I will be showing you today is this uh, Grumman Ag Cat. Uh, these aircraft were originally built by Grumman, and they are now built by Schweizer, which is a German glider company. Um, this, air, this particular aircraft maxed out on its hours. You measure how long an aircraft can fly before you rebuild it in hours, not miles like a car. Once you max out on your hours, it's pretty much a pile of spare parts unless you rebuild the aircraft. Uh, that's what happened to this aircraft in particular. So we chopped the tail off, put an electric generator inside, and removed the cylinders. And uh, now we can uh, turn it on. So uh, this is one of our displays we've had since the museum first opened. Um, this air aircraft has a Pratt & Whitney R-985 uh, Wasp Miner 9-cylinder radial engine. Uh, they were also equipped with uh, Pratt & Whitney R-1300 9-cylinder radial engines. And uh, all, all aluminum alloy construction with four ailerons for maneuverability. And uh, top speed on this is about 80 miles per hour. Um, well, uh, working speed on this is 80 miles per hour. Top speed isn't faster than that, around 90 to 100. Uh, this aircraft also uses what's called a super boom which um, has a little wooden propeller. How it works is uh, that little wooden propeller is driven by the main uh, aircraft's engine or propeller, which um, that acts as a pump that pumps the chemicals from that tank into the super boom. Much more economic and safer than previous methods used for crop spraying, as um, it covers a wider area using less chemicals, and you get done much quicker than on a than, uh, normal crop spray. Um, so yeah, that's about it for this aircraft, and uh, thank you for watching, and remember to comment, rate, and subscribe.